Good morning guys, welcome to Copenhagen. Let us take a jump into my office. It's really early, the sun is just coming up. It's a little bit cloudy. Fishermen are just returning from their fishing trips. Maybe we catch one of the fishermen here and see if they caught a lot of fish, guys. It's a beautiful day again here on Copangan. I hope you're having a beautiful day as well and at your place, wherever you might be, locked down or not. I'm very happy, guys, that I can tell you that we almost reached 4,000 watch hours, which uh, almost makes it possible for us to monetize the channel. So we need another 300 hours, 300 hours, and then we will be able to monetize the channel. And as I already said a few times, the monetization of the channel, we will use this to help poor people all over the world and again, make videos about it so that we can show by leading by example what you can also do when you make some money, you can also help other people. So please, when you leave the house today, whatever you do, shopping or whatever, just put my playlist on play so we reach those 300 hours very soon. The news today, guys, yes, Atari. Do you still remember Atari? Atari was about my time of gaming before the Nintendo and everything came. They are now joining forces with Arcane Group and together they will launch a token, an Atari token that, that gamers can use online to change or sell or buy in-game assets, which is really cool because yesterday I already said that the gaming will be huge and now Atari, one of the big giants from the 70s, announced this co-op with Arcane Gaming. So this is going to provide us with some more fun in blockchain and using tokens um, while we game at the same time. Yes, they already said you can make money now with gaming. I still have the link in the description, so do sign up and join me in this game where you can uh, win some bitcoins by playing a Fortnite-like game. There is not many news today, guys, um, so I will just try to talk about a few things that are happening in my life and of course I will end with the Bitcoin price but at the moment I'm looking forward to start and work together with a beautiful company um, that really has an amazing product I can't say the name yet but soon I will tell you more and you will be amazed by the possibilities this company is providing you in this crypto space and man it's going to be a small revolution in that part of the crypto industry so um, keep watching the videos soon i can tell you more and i think you will love it and uh, you will love to use it i can give you one hint it can provide you of a monthly income in a very simple way and no it's not multi-level marketing and no it's not one of those scam things okay that was all i can say but i will say and i will tell you more in the in the future guys i i'm really excited it's on the tip of my tongue but i can't um, you can't say more at the moment. I, I, I really need to wait until everything is uh, cleared up and um, and then I will be happy to share this uh, beautiful partnership with you guys. Okay, <laughs> yeah, now you got curious of course. When you say A, you need to see B and C as well. Yeah, this time I can't. But guys, there was some news about the price, of course. A lot of news about the price uh, late, lately because I think it's just the most important part for many people in this space. I hope with my videos I can slowly educate people that the other part of the space, the fundamentals and you know, what is Bitcoin changing to the monetary system. Um, you know, people will understand it because of my videos a little bit more. But you know, you just lo love to hear me talk about the price. So I will do this as well. But I secretly slip these secret messages into your brain. And then I try to program you to this new crypto dude that supports it for multiple reasons and not only the price. <laughs> Maybe that's the way I do it. So there was this news again by one of these billionaires that said, okay, you know, everybody is screaming, Bitcoin could, could be 500,000, Bitcoin could be a million. You know, you hear all these amounts and even I use these amounts um, as clickbait, to be honest, in my videos because you know, you need to have these catchy titles in YouTube to get new followers. And yes, you know, this is not really my style. I'm not the clickbait type. 
it's just part of the game and uh, this old dude needs to play this game as well <laughs> to get ranked a little bit higher and get more followers but this this guy is saying yes we you know we can see 500,000 bitcoin 1 million bitcoin how why are we thinking this is it because we just do it like this or do we really calculate it so what appears is that they really calculated everything and how because they have a lot of experience in the traditional financial market so they know the numbers of the traditional financial market that's how they calculate how high bitcoin could go because there is one very stable factor in bitcoin and that is that we know there are 21 million bitcoins this is not going to change yes it can change in how much bitcoins are available because you know some bitcoins got lost because people lost their private keys and all that stuff but still it never can become more than 21 million and if you know that this is a stable factor that there are only 21 million bitcoins then you can calculate how much money goes around in this beautiful world we are living for example the bitcoin market gap today is about 180 billion okay that sounds like a huge number but if you compare it to other market caps it's nothing let's take amazon as a company Amazon has a value of 970 billion. That's already seven times the Bitcoin market gap. That's just one company. Another example, let's take the US dollar. How much US dollars are there, are there in circulation? Like physical circulation, coins, paper money, and all that stuff. That's about 1.5 trillion, only US dollars. So 1.5 trillion is again almost 10 times the Bitcoin market cap. That shows how small Bitcoin is. But let's take it further. We can even show more how small Bitcoin really is. If we compare it to gold, because all the market is always comparing Bitcoin to gold, because yes, we are seeing Bitcoin as a store of value at the moment. No, it wasn't the gold. The goal was to be peer-to-peer -peer cash. But you know, you just go with the flow. And at the moment, in this part of the evolution of the technology of blockchain and Bitcoin, yes, we need to admit it's more kind of a store of value because the transactions fee are that too high to do micropayments. And if you compare it to gold, the gold market cap is 7.8 trillion somewhere. So that's like so many times the Bitcoin market cap. This means, let's say like 5% of the gold market cap, 5% of the 7.8 trillion will go into Bitcoin that would already like triple or quadruple the Bitcoin market cap and thus the price because the supply will be still the same 21 million Bitcoins but there is more money floating into the market and that's only gold we can compare it even to all the money around the world that's like about 35 trillion dollar compare bitcoin to that with 1.7 billion it's nothing it's nothing if even 10 percent goes into this the bitcoin price needs a moon already to four hundred thousand dollars or something yes i'm now just shouting these numbers out the top of my head but i'm just trying to show to you guys how big bitcoin can be influenced if those institutional investors and big players of the market decide to diversify their portfolio that they have now invested in gold, silver, or the stock market, and now change the little percentage of this into Bitcoin, then the Bitcoin price will already skyrocket because there is a fixed supply of 21 million. There is not going to be more Bitcoins. And if we are talking about the stock market, I think the stock market is about $70 trillion big. Guys, I hope you understand what I'm trying to say. We have a market cap in Bitcoin of 170 billion. If you look at all those trillions all over the world that are now invested by very smart institutional investors, and you can understand that they are also seeing this market slowly crash now. You know, they can see that their assets are becoming less valuable because of the huge crisis. And at the same time, they also see that Bitcoin has been decoupling from the stock market. If, if you compare Bitcoin to the stock market now the last 
a few weeks bitcoin has been going up with eight percent the stock market has been going down with four percent it's a difference of twelve percent a twelve percent difference that would be a lot of money for all those investors so these investors know that bitcoin is becoming this real player in the market and these investors will diversify their portfolio they have been diversifying their portfolio forever they never go all in like me i'm this crazy guy that goes all in into one asset a real investor that thinks the market through will always diversify its portfolio so he will some have some gold he will have some real estate he will have some stocks he will have all of these things so if all these investors use just a small percentage of all their you know portfolio that is now invested in these other things like gold and real estate then the market cap of bitcoin is already going times 10. so then 1.170 billion will go to 1.7 trillion and if you divide 1.7 trillion by the 21 million bitcoins you can calculate the bitcoin price yourself because i can't do it now out the top of my head but it's way way higher than the price we are seeing at the moment so that's a little bit how i look at the huge market and why i think that all these big billionaire investment companies and players are now saying wow bitcoin could even go to 500,000." and please understand even this is all mass media they know how to play this game they have already been accumulating bitcoin everybody can read this paul tudor jeff Bezos, jack dorsey the twitter ceo all these guys have been accumulating bitcoin so believe me if they hold bitcoin and accumulate bitcoin they will talk very positive the next couple of years about this asset because they want it to go up and they have a huge influence in the media if they something it will be a cbnc it will be in the wall street journal it will be in all the newspapers all the world because now jack dorsey says bitcoin is good now you know jack ma from alibaba says oh bitcoin is good we buy bitcoin if all these people keep repeating it you know they they keep convincing other people about the value of bitcoin and other people will start to buy 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 and that's how the price also drives up so this is also a game for them i think but you can play this game or you can just sit it out but if you sit it out don't come back to me and complain in a few years times because I made all these videos for you so you would just join the game even if you can only join with one bitcoin or 0.1 bitcoin or 0.2 bitcoin it's a nice game to play if it comes to the bitcoin price guys you know it's a small let's say let's call it a war <laughs> it's a war we need to break ten thousand five hundred dollars i've i've said this many times in my latest videos we have a multi-year trend line going down from 20,000 to 14,000 and we are now around 10,500 with this trend line and we need to break it this is the resistance this is the most important resistance we need to break it's 10,500 US dollar per Bitcoin on the other side we have another trend line one let's call it the bearish one and that one is showing us support around six thousand three hundred dollars you can see it in the chart i'm sharing with you guys so that one is six thousand three hundred dollars it is not a coincidence that this support of six thousand three hundred dollars is also the 0 0.5 fibonacci retracement level these fibonacci retracement levels yes that's a difficult word um, they have shown in history that these are the levels where bitcoin price will go back to after a run or after a huge drop these two levels are the important levels to keep an eye on we need to break 10,500, which is huge and it's difficult but i think we are going to do it and if not it could be possible that we drop back to six thousand dollars so don't freak out when we do just when you see that we start to retrace from 10,500, and when and you hit the line and we are not crossing it but we are falling back 
you can always exchange your bitcoins into a usd tether to buy them back again at 6k or don't even play this game and just zoom out in the long term because if we fall back to 6k that doesn't mean bitcoin goes to zero or the fundamentals are not working anymore it just means that 6k will be the new support and we will fly up from there again because the bull market will not happen in the next week or in the next two weeks or three weeks it will happen in the long term and it will take maybe even till the end of next year yeah that's going to be a long year but man you can just enjoy every day with simple things in life and then before you know it a few months flew by and bitcoin is high in the sky wow that even rhymed the only thing i can tell you as well is that since i've been making this video our shop has been very busy um, you know we have this online shop uh, where we sell bitcoin t-shirts uh, let it be to be or not to be miss be all these kinds of lyrics beautiful printed on uh, t-shirts thank you for ordering the shirts even of these sales you can read it on the website i think it's 25 percent of the sales goes to charity so that's a huge thank there for buying all the shirts wait i will make a game out of it the one that comments with the most creative text to put on the bitcoin shirt i will have this shirt made and you will get this shirt as a present for me and the last thing guys i want to tell you is that yesterday i received my new Embly card Embly card is a crypto debit card that you can use all over the world where mastercard is accepted so it's an amazing card they had a beautiful one designed for me specially designed i will show you the card um, it's 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 gold it has my head on it the bitcoin family on it it feels really heavy and i'm very excited i, I received it yesterday evening and I'm, I'm going to try to use it tomorrow or the day after and film this and show you how this card is working it's a card where you can send your bitcoins or many other cryptos you send them to the card and then you use this card everywhere in the world where mastercard is accepted yes it's not peer-to-peer -peer bitcoin payments that is the goal of course of bitcoin but this is a very nice step in between for people like me that are all in in bitcoin we don't have bank accounts so we need to have the possibility to buy some new shoes for the kids or to buy a new iphone because it broke you know <laughs> and we still need to make these videos and then we can use these kinds of cards where we send our bitcoin to and then we just pay directly so we can hodl our bitcoin till the end till the moment we will spend it and this is the game we play so check this this card it's beautiful and let me know what you think about it okay guys thank you for watching this video again please give it a thumbs up if you like it and um, hit the bell button to be notified on every new video or just check in every day because you know now that i make a video every day and share it please with your uh, community and let's let's crush this watch hours resistance because we want to start monetizing it have an amazing day live that day to the fullest and see you guys tomorrow again bye